Now, uh, I, when I travel, I do, uh, I'm a souvenir junkie, but I had to streamline some of my souvenirs because a lot of stuff, I know when I die, the kids are going to just trash it anyway, but one of the things that my sister-in-law got to start into is these coffee mugs from Starbucks. They're about $12, $13 where we go. States and cities slash uh, foreign countries slash things like Disneyland, Pikes Place, Arizona State, because that's where I, where I grew up, to Florida Keys, Tur Turkish Caicos, to, to uh, uh, Mexico, British Columbia, Canada, things, things like that. Uh, minus 10 states that I've been to. But slowly but surely when the family's been going to uh, these places, they know they know to pick me up when they hit the call hey dad or uncle mike do you have this and this and this and i'll tell them no i don't I, I, but i do need it so some of these they'll bring to me uh i need 10 that i haven't that i that they weren't around when we've been to those different states and there's two different kinds you have been there series then you, you were there. I don't know the difference. I'll look at the mugs and I can't tell the difference between the two. But then they they came out with another one, which is supposedly somewhat different. But they're tw they're twenty dollars. I don't think I'm going to start collecting those either. I I got to try to catch up on these to begin with. But we don't. Dr I don't drink coffee, and I don't drink hot hot chocolate either. But it's just something to collect. My sister-in-law that got us into it, she drinks all hot chocolate. And she she actually uses the cups and stuff like that, which is okay. But uh, I got 11 more slots for the 10 states I've been to or any other state I might go into in the future. But now, if I need a third one, I'll get a third one. But that's a fun thing to do wherever you see a Starbucks, is to grab a Star Starbucks coffee mug.